a team of archaeologists discovered something incredible, which dated back to the Byzantine era. A bizarre discovery in Egypt along the banks of the Nile has experts stumped. They find 10 bodies in total laid side by side. But why were they buried here? None of the bodies show signs that they suffered a violent death at the hands of humans or other animals. So what happened to these crocodiles? One of the crocodiles has a healed fracture on its dorsal ribs and two healed fractures on its ventral ribs. Another has a healed fracture on its fibula and lesions on its left metatarsal and right metacarpal. But these injuries wouldn't have been severe enough to kill them. They were likely the result of territorial fights. They found West African and Nile crocodiles, both of which were native to the area. They're very similar in appearance, but West African crocodiles tend to be smaller and less aggressive than their Nile counterparts, which are estimated to be responsible for up to 200 deaths each year. Further investigation found small fragments of linen with the bodies. Egyptians were known to wrap human bodies in linen as part of the burial process. Its presence suggests that someone buried these crocodiles here for a reason. Ancient crocodile remains have been found in other parts of Egypt, most famously at Komombo. Approximately 50 kilometers north of Kubat al Hawa, the town contains a temple dedicated to the god Sobek, who manifested as a crocodile. Thousands of crocodiles have been excavated around Kamombo, and many were found to be wrapped in linen as part of the mummification process. So it's logical to conclude that the bodies found at Kabat al Hawa aren't just regular crocodiles, they're crocodile mummies.